initializing. Welcome to Infinite Guides, I'm Zacubus and I'm showing you the guidebook into Infinite Crisis. And first up we've got a lesson on support and how it should be done right. So Batman here has been doing a great job harassing me out of the lane so I can't get any experience or XP so I've had to wait very patiently for the right opportunities before I can actually get some experience and luckily he's pushing up the drone wave for me to my tower and where I can slowly farm them at the safety of the tower. He's not going to harass me there but Satana has other ideas. Now, she may think she's helping here, but her playing overly aggressive on these drones is actually helping the enemy more than she thinks. You know, it seems to make sense to clear a wave like this, but really we want to hold them in this mid area where I've highlighted here for a good one, two, three minutes where we can safely farm and get our experience up. But when she continuously plays aggressive on the drones in the middle here, what happens is, is that our drones will be pushed up to the enemy tower and they will be able to get experience and you know really take control of the situation now it's a painful experience to be in this position again because i can't get any xp i can't get any credits going the tower we could have done a lot of damage to if we had a bigger drone wave which would have been gradually pushed up and mecha wonder woman here can just take as much time as she wants to farm and get leveled and this is really really bad for us because we're in a very good position to get ganked as well we're on the enemy's half of the map so batman could come back into this lane and really really hurt us and you don't want to be in this position at all it's slightly annoying but let's see what happens when you actually do it right so this is how to really play support well in a lane so you, as you can see poison ivy is doing a great job harassing atomic wonder Woman out the lane and when there's no last hits to be made i'm doing some damage myself as well as you can see these drones in the middle are not getting attacked by ivy at all i am the only one attacking them when they're ready to be last hit just getting that last hit means that the lane stays in this static farming mode. As you can see, it's just staying put in this mid area. This is exactly what we want. This gives us a huge advantage for me to farm. It keeps me in a safe position that I'm not on the enemy side of the map. And also, our drones will gradually, gradually get a bigger wave coming in, while theirs are diminished and we'll be able to do more damage on that tower and more damage to Atomic Wonder Woman as well, theoretically. So this is a great position to be in and Poison Ivy is doing a great job just doing some nice support work here. I hope you enjoyed this guide. It's just one example of the laning stage and showing you how to keep that equilibrium of keeping the drones in the middle as long as possible or by your tower as long as possible. There'll be many more lessons like this I hope to do in the future. So stick around, keep watching, like, comment, subscribe, dislike, tell me what you didn't like, what you'd like to see more of. You know, just put in some input, guys. It really helps me out as well. Uh, and I really hope you enjoyed this.